So here's the problem. You guys can see that right now I have four monitors and the sun is really strong in my face. And if you actually turn this camera around, you guys can see it's a pretty nice view. But the real problem over here is not the view, but it's the sun. So I'll show you guys something more. It is already almost 30 degrees and it's not even 9 a.m. So I'm having some pretty decent problems. So like I said before, we're gonna install this fifth monitor right over here so at least we get less reflection in these screen because it's just too much and I can't deal with 30 degrees and sun in my eyes when I'm trying to prep for my morning session. All right, so the market is about to open in 10 minutes, but I have nothing to trade because nothing fits my playbook. So I'll revisit everything around 10 a.m. If there's still nothing, I'll come back at 2 p.m. But let's first talk about this monitor and why I'm actually doing this. So first, the sun is really coming into my eyes in the morning and that's good, but that's also annoying because you can't really see and it's very draining, let's put it this way but there's something that could have been done that would have been probably smarter and that is installing curtains but the reason why i'm not doing it is i'm not sure if i'm gonna stay here so i'm trying to just patch it and figure out a way to just get by until i make that decision and if i do i'll install some and i'll spend the money but if i don't then i just don't want to spend it and i'd rather spend the money on extra screen because who doesn't like extra screen you know All right, so what we have for this build is not much, to be honest. We only have a mount over here. I have no clue what it looks like, and hopefully that's not my address, and uh, hopefully it works. And we have the 32-inch Samsung 4K monitor, and we're actually gonna plug it today. We're gonna see what it looks like, and we'll do a comparison between the 2K resolution and the 4K, because it is a big difference, and I did try it before, so we'll see how it looks and also how you feel when we look at charts to maybe change everything at one point, who knows? Yeah, um, I thought it was gonna be less pieces than this, but uh, apparently we're gonna have fun. And by the way, everything will be linked down in the description. So if you're looking for what it looks like, a pretty decent mount, it's gonna be linked down there with everything else that you see here. You have to be so careful when you're taking off that little Velcro there because otherwise the mount is gonna break everything around it. It's so like, it's actually really strong and really springy. All right guys, so uh, step one is complete. And as you guys can see, it's pretty pretty interesting. Like look, the 32s are exactly equivalent to 227 when you stack them. So if you're looking for you know something more square, this could be a good thing, I guess. And uh, yeah, overall, it does block the sun. So now um, what I love to do is really to plug everything to compare the 27 to the 32 when it comes to resolution. So uh, let's do that. So this over here is actually an LG 42 inch 4K monitor. And this is where we're gonna take the power supply from. So the only thing left to do is to just, you know, close all of these programs. And after that, you guys are gonna be able to see what you've been here for this whole time. You know, it's been a while. So we kind of have a bad news over here. So we can see that this monitor there, it doesn't pick up the resolution, I think. Oh, I'm pretty sure it's just because my graphic card is maxed out. So for comparison, what I'll do is I'll just disconnect one of them and just connect this one instead. 
All right, guys, we did our best to install it, but you guys can see when it comes just to the size, um, how like small the 27 looks compared to the 32. And also, uh, for some reason, the, the lighting, I can't change it on that 32 for now. I think my graphic card is really having problem or something like that. But first size compares this when it comes to resolution. I put um, over here, so this is eight charts. So you guys can see kind of the, the how small they are versus this is eight chart also. And you guys can see like this is like a full hand, like it's pretty wide. And this one is like a couple fingers. So massive difference. And if I open some other software to really show you guys, uh, you know, like this page normally takes about half of my screen, maybe a little bit less. If I put it over here, it just takes like a, a tiny portion. So it's pretty good uh, when it comes to, you know, adding space. But the big difference is look at the font, how um, big over here it is, and look at the font over here, how small it is. So a lot of the time, what you're gonna have to do is zoom in all your fonts to make it look better, and just to make it readable. Otherwise, uh, it just doesn't make sense. So when it comes to screen, I honestly prefer the 27. They're just more compact, and it feels like better for the eyes, just the font is a bit bigger, and I don't know, it's less traveling for your neck and for your, your head or something like that. When it comes to 32, you can put more stuff on your screen. So if you're gonna be having like two 32 inch instead of like four uh, 27 or maybe three 32 would actually be the exact same resolution, I believe. It wouldn't make sense, but for me, I just prefer to have the 427 and this is gonna be a perfect sun blocker or if ever I find a different solution, I'll just sell it. So thanks for watching. If you enjoy, like and subscribe. Peace.